Hello, Steve White, Steve Arts 89. Well, Madonna's new video for the Frozen remix from um, Sick Kick just came out. Uh, I got a little alert, which it was funny to get an alert for a Madonna video. I don't think I've ever gotten an alert for a Madonna video before. Um, and it was okay. Um, I wasn't really impressed, honestly. Um, but I wasn't expecting to be because when I looked at um, the making of and all the sort of footage we're seeing, it, it looked very simple very inexpensive, um, basically just Madonna standing on a stage, it was painted blue, um, just a plain stage with a line between the floor and the wall and that's sort of it. Um, her dressed up like a fetish object and um, the uh, rapper um, Fireboy and that's really all. So I wasn't expecting a lot from it um, and I didn't get a lot from it. There isn't a big narrative um, involved. Basically it starts off with um, Madonna standing in a smoky room and she's walking towards the camera. Um, she's dressed in like a fetish outfit. She's got the blonde hair, uh, pretty much what we've seen all the photos from. There's a close-up of her eye. We see shots of a highway. Um, I mean, I'm watching the video now, but it's basically very repetitive. Um, just the same sort of images. We do actually get flashbacks to the original Frozen video. We see the dog, we see some sky, we see uh, the crows um, coming out of um, her falling. We see um, the like the desert floor and that. Um, and the colour, of course, is the same palette for the most part, the blues. But it's mostly just Madonna standing, dressed as a fetish object, just posing, moving. She's not really... There's no real choreography, there's no real narrative, nothing really happens in the video. It's just a lot of standing and posing and um, the dynamic really in the original video was it was Madonna singing to herself about having her heart being closed and opening her heart and the reason why there were the three Madonnas in the video and that was that it was um, an internal thing. Whereas this it's more literal where we have um, this guy, Fireboy, who does um, a rap during um, the actual video. He is basically appealing to Madonna, um, you know, to literally warm up because she's frozen him out. Um, so she's mostly standing, ignoring him while he's at her feet and dancing around her and trying to get her attention. There's fire in the background, there's a car that blows up, there's, um, there's, there's a lot of image, some, some imagery that is actually projected over the back of the wall and um, that's sort of sort of mix in amongst but you don't really get a sense of anything actually happening really outside of them. It seems very just superficial and visual. Um, and the other dress that we saw her in which is very conservative for Madonna because she's actually wearing like a bodysuit with this string dress over it so it's supposed to look like she's naked but it's really um, she's totally covered and it's probably the most conservative she's been in a video ever because she's basically covered from head to toe. Um, that's mostly shown in negative, so it's like, you know, her skin is black and it's like the lines are all white. So we don't really see that dress. I was expecting them to do something really interesting with that and to really use the contrast and the lines and all that, um, but they really don't. Um, and then the video pretty much ends with the two of them walking towards the camera while there's a, um, a road projected in the background and they walk to the camera separately and then together. Um, we have a little shot of Sick Kick's um, helmet and that's sort of the end of the video. It's only 2 minutes and 47 seconds long. Um, and yet not a lot happens in it. I was kind not, like I said, I wasn't expecting much. I was a little disappointed because I thought they would have played a bit more with some of the original um, imagery of the song and the original sort of themes of the song instead of just sort of doing just this literal, you know, guy trying to get her, um, win her heart, get, you know, unfreeze her heart basically. <laughs> Um, so yeah, um, I don't know, it's, it's, it's nice, it's nice to have a video for the song, I do like the mix, I, I didn't really like the way they sort of slowed the voice down, but I do like the overall mix, so, um, I don't know, hopefully it'll achieve something. Um, she hasn't had a, a commercial hit for a while, um, I know TikTok and, um, Spotify, she's, she's getting some attention with this single and with Material Girl and some other things. So this is all, I guess, working towards a stronger um, online and digital presence as opposed to um, physical sales where she's usually sort of, you know, done most of her, got most of her attention, I guess, but um, and done most of her sales. But she does have to work on this. She does have to engage, you know, the kids. 
So I don't know, we'll see how this helps, how what this does. Um, like it's a nice video, it's just, I just was expecting something more structured, something, um, it just feels really, um, I don't know what word to put, no, not, not, I keep thinking performative, but it's just very much just standing, posing, images, there doesn't seem to be a lot of depth or structure to it. Um, and we expect a lot from a Madonna video, you know, um, and yeah, we haven't seen that for a while. So she seems to have abandoned the art form she kind of created and um, on some levels. So I don't know. I'm going to go. Feel free to share, like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think of it. I'm going to go. Thanks. Bye.